Hello everyone, this is Nadine Dossier of EnergyWorksHealers.com. Thank you so much for joining me. Today, we are gonna take our psychic senses back, our psychic powers back, so that they are honoring us, so they're helping us, making our life easier, and helping us really to align with our divine truth, with our divine plan that our psychic senses are helping us to tune into the truth, tune into divine love, rather than connecting us to lower frequencies that are causing confusion or causing us to get drained or feel very fearful. Uh, they could be causing all kinds of symptoms when we're connected to information that isn't useful for us. And think about it. We are suffering on a large scale of living in a time where we <laughs> get way too much information coming our way. We get very overwhelmed. And it's really important for us to, when we're feeling overwhelmed, to come within. And because wherever our energy, our focus is, is wherever our energy is flowing. So where, wherever the focus goes, that's where the energy flows. So we can get drained really easily having too much energy out here. So we are going to feel so empowered and I, what I'm gonna invite you to do is try this practice for 21 or 30 days, a period of time where it becomes like second nature to you and you really feel like you are in charge of these amazing gifts that you have. So the first thing that I like us to do is offer gratitude. No matter where we are at with our psychic senses, we may feel like some are too strong, some are not strong enough. Let us offer our gratitude for all of our psychic gifts. All of the chakras have psychic gifts, particularly the seven major chakras. Each has their own gifts and abilities. And we are most in tune when they're working together. And a lot of times, honestly, we're in denial about <laughs> how much information is coming in and think that we're not that intuitive in certain areas when we really truly are. So let us again focus on giving gratitude for this, for being so much more than this physical body, this personality, and being able to tune in to infinite divine wisdom, connect with our spirit guides and our higher self. What a gift it is to connect telepathically with trees and animals and tune in with all of life with these gifts. What a, what a blessing it truly is. And let's invite all of our angels, guides, and guardians, and our higher self to gather around us now, creating a sacred space. Let them touch and light up all of our chakras so that we're able to tune in and see where we're at energetically. As we close our eyes together, just want you to feel, sense, and know that all of the chakras have antennae that are connecting with the world around us and the universe. Now we're gonna ask our higher self and our guides to focus in right now on any of our chakras, any of our antennae, any of our auric field that is tuned into energy that is not helpful for us. Any of our energy that's focused in lower dimensions or focused in a human energy field where it doesn't belong. 
or if we're connected in some murky field of uh, human thought forms or human emotion, that these antennae are retracted now and they're being cleansed as they come back, back, back into our system, fully cleansed and cleared. We're retreating out of any energetic or informational field that does not align us with our truth. Anything based in fear or negativity. We're taking our energy back, cleansed and cleared. Let us take nine deep breaths and allow this process just to complete itself. Intend to take your power back, your life force back now. Continue breathing, almost there. Now we're going to focus on our antennae that are connected with divine dimensions. Just see where you're at or feel where you're at. And now we're going to ask that our psychic connection to the divine, to our angels, guides, and guardians, to our higher self, to the Supreme Divine Source of Love is now brought to its highest capacity that is appropriate for us at this time. And you will feel some of your antennae that were already there strengthened and you will feel others that were once retracting from inappropriate places begin to extend into the divine dimensions. You may be connecting with specific helpers and specific dimensions that can support you in certain healings that you're experiencing right now on your soul's evolution. They can be helping you with certain projects, helping you with your life purpose. Let's take nine deep breaths and just really feel and sense ourselves being so connected with the divine in synchronicity, magic, miracles, and connected with infinite wisdom. Everything that we need to know to support us at this time.
one more. Huge rainbow infinity symbol above your soul star. And one rainbow infinity symbol beneath you, beneath your feet at the earth star level. Archangel Michael is now placing a tube of the blue flame of divine will within and all around you to help you stay protected and focused on your path. Focused on the target, focused on what is wanted rather than, is, than what is not wanted or not helpful. Let us again offer our gratitude to all of our spirit helpers and just offer ourselves as open, open, open to their divine love and their support. We are open, we are ready. Thank you. And like we said, we would love for you to practice this every day. If you're really wanting to activate your psychic senses on a deeper level, my sister and I have created a amazing channeling course. And we've seen so many healers really take off with their work after taking the course. And we really, it's amazing to see that happen. So if you're interested, I'll have links down below. Um, for our channeling course. And uh, we do talk about all the psychic senses in there and the different chakras. So thank you so much. I please don't forget, use this every day to really get a strong hold on your psychic senses and your amazing gifts. Thank you so much. Take care.